Good morning, Twitter folks. The Zor Man here, Zor Trades, December 10th, 2010, 7 o'clock in the morning. I'm here today as always with your money stock of the day. Friday, looking forward to the weekend and also Mutual Fund Merger Monday. But before we get too giddy about Merger Monday and Mutual Fund Monday, here's a chart that I posted yesterday of the S&P 500 plotted with the times that the ISEE, all securities caught to put ratio, closed above 180, which it, which it really doesn't happen. It doesn't normally happen. There's been a few instances ever since 2009. As you can see here, it happened here. Got a few more days of upside action, then a little dump here, a couple of down days, but then mostly uh, uh, sideways action before we went higher. Here, 415, uh, we moved lower. Then we went back up, then we had the flash crash. Here we did it again. You know, we had to move higher just to give it all up. And here we had it twice over the last week or so. This is something to think about. Because again, it just seems that, for example, the SIBO equity only put to call ratio has been under 50, has closed under 0.56 out of the last seven days. That means people are buying two calls for every put. Normally, when we get to these type of levels, you have to be careful. It's a food for thought. On the flip side, this is the Santa Claus rally. December is normally a good month, so you have some seasonal factors. But either way, when you're, when you're looking to buy something, keep this in mind and perhaps reduce your position a little bit. Don't risk 1% of your account per trade. Perhaps risk 0.50 or 0.25. But without further ado... Let's take a look at the money stocks of the day. I got three for it's a three for day. It's a three for one day. What we have here is Cartronics CATM on the NASDAQ. As you can see here, the stock is about to form possibly what I call the ILUJ formation. Uh, here is the I, here is the L, then we're looking for a possible U. Uh, the stock has been trading sideways for roughly 10 to 15 days. I like this stock going through $17.15. Next on the list is ACCL, uh, Acceleries Incorporated. Stock had a very decent move, has been trading sideways over the last couple of days. As you can see, the 20 day has been catching up. The stock is compressing. I love this stock going through A60. Above A60, the Zorman is all over it. Uh, next on the list is Saks Fifth Avenue, a little Christmas play. You know, stock is heavily shorted. About 16% of the float is short. As you can see here, the stock has been forming what I call the ILUJ. Here's the I, here's the L. We're looking to form the U and then possibly the J. I like the stock going through $11.75. It does that, and you have the possibility of having a decent short squeeze. Either way, I hope you guys have been making money with my money stock of the you know my money stock of the day and also my Zortology show on Monday. We've been killing it. So Again, stay tuned, be well, trade them well, and I'll see you guys back on the stream.